Good morning, fans of Privateer FX. Trade war is on. Equities have come off half percent or so. Um, yen crosses, I guess. Dollar yen today, left hand side. We traded down to 30 already in dollar yen. <coughs> the real interesting point is going to be 109.93. Uh, in the next couple of days. We have no data today. We have Draghi speaking tonight, 7.30 p.m. Swiss time from Portugal. That could be interesting. Uh, but in general, we're selling dollar yen, selling euro yen, uh, or core short from the end of last week. We will be adding through 70. And today also we're going to be selling Aussie Yen on moves between 25 here and 55. Who loses in a trade war? You could argue both sides are going to lose. The global economy is going to lose. On paper, China has more to lose. But the political process in America is going to force Trump, who sort of makes, makes it so Trump has more to lose, the electoral process, whereas in China, it's just pure economics. Numbers have rolled over there already. Uh, a trade war is only going to exacerbate that. That said, uh, you know, President Xi, excuse the pronunciation, um, where the government in China could easily turn this into some sort of nationalist issue and sort of obfuscate the uh, economic troubles and blame the evil Americans. It'll be interesting to watch, uh, but it looks like it's going to be risk off and looks like this is going to be, I don't know, heading into the 4th of July. This is just going to linger and, and continue. you got to watch headlines and just be disciplined because if this gets fixed on some sort of Trump reversal uh, there'll, be a sh there'll be lots of short cover but for now uh, we think risk off quietly risk off is the way we're not going to sell low ones here at the open uh, but we're more interested in selling high ones dollar yen, yen crosses S&P's, we're going to wait for New York to do anything. Elsewhere, not too much. Crypto is pretty flat. Um, cable, 132 the figure this week is going to be extremely important. Not sure it's going to go there today. We're just sort of right in the middle now. Um, but keep an eye on 132. Prices through 132 should lead to prices all the way down to 130 so there's money to be made on an hourly close below 132 that's about it uh, you could argue you want to buy dollar cat on dips but you know low 131 seems unlikely for now especially with risk off there'll be cad yen sales um, so our focus is yen and selling high ones today. I'll check back in at the New York Open and talk to you all later. Ciao.